help me. Like, and if you're sorry, just help me. Like, it looks like Kylie Jenner still has beef with Megan Thee Stallion, and she's now trying to get back at her by helping Tory Lanez. Kylie is set to testify as Tory's witness in Megan's upcoming trial against Tory over the infamous 2020 shooting incident. But why is Kylie even inserting herself in this situation? Why is she going out of her way to help Tory? Well, fans are saying Kylie's always been jealous of Meghan, and just like the rest of the Kardashian-Jenner clan, she can't miss out on an opportunity to put down a black woman. I really thought that we were all friends. And it's sometimes I feel like I put the blame on myself because when my mom passed, I just felt like I was looking for some type of family environment, and I was letting so many people in. This whole drama is seriously messy, and it paints Kylie in a really bad light. So let's get into it. As you all probably know, Megan Thee Stallion is dealing with an ongoing case against Tory Lanez over the shooting incident that happened back in June 2020 after a pool party at Kylie Jenner's house. And although Tory tried really hard to push back the trial and was a no-show at several court hearings, it's just been confirmed that the case is going to trial in a matter of days. According to a new report from Rolling Stone magazine, Tory was recently released from house arrest to prepare for the trial, and the jury selection process started on Monday, December 5th. Tory has been placed on house arrest in October to wait for the trial following the allegations that he physically attacked August Alsina in Chicago the previous month. However, Los Angeles County Superior Court Judge David Hereford said on Monday that the main reason he decided to release Tory from house arrest is that during the trial, it's difficult to have a client who's not accessible, and added that the decision was necessary for the trial preparation aspect. Deputy District Attorney Kathy Ta, however, tried to fight the judge's decision, pointing out that Tory previously tried to sway and intimidate witnesses in this case. She also said that there are a couple of witnesses who might be affected by this decision and asked the judge to at least force Tory to keep his ankle monitor. However, the judge denied her request and ruled that Tory can remove the tracking device. Opening statements are set to begin on December 12th, and Megan is expected to testify against Tory. But it looks like Tory has already started gathering witnesses who might have a vested interest in testifying against Megan, and one of them is Kylie Jenner. Now, the shooting did happen after a pool party at Kylie Jenner's house that Meghan and Tori both attended, but Kylie wasn't present at the time of the incident, so it's very surprising that she's now getting involved in all this. Because when Kylie was summoned to testify in Black China's case, she tried really hard to get out of it, and her lawyer literally said that Kylie and her sisters are, quote, too busy running billion-dollar companies, and that getting deposed is an unwarranted annoyance. So how come Kylie's suddenly not too busy to testify against Megan about a case that doesn't even concern her at all? During the December 5th hearing, Tory's lawyer told the court that Kylie Jenner and, for some random reason, Kris Jenner's boyfriend, Corey Gamble, are both on Tory's defense's witness list. Tory's lawyer explained that Kylie and Corey are listed as witnesses because everything started during a pool party at Kylie's house and Corey was in attendance, adding that Kylie's testimony in particular could provide context about how this incident began. Now, the fact that Corey even attended a late night pool party at Kylie's house is weird all on its own, but let's not even get into that. The bigger issue here is how come Kylie wants to help Tory in this case when all evidence points to him being guilty? For example, 